Good morning and welcome to the podcast. My guest today is Kimberly Keller. She is with, I give the official title, Legacy Busira Skilled Nursing and Rehabilitation. Uh, welcome to the podcast. Welcome back. Well, thank you and good morning. All right. Good morning to you. I, uh, we may want to tell people since they probably, some of us may still not know what your legacy is in Busira. It's the former ProMedica. Yes, and Heartland. And former Heartland. That's for that should locate everybody in the last 50 years, folks. That's right. That's so that right. should pretty much get us all up to date on where you're located, which is out on West Mansfield Street. Yes, yes, just west of the um, Bucyrus High School. There you go. And I should say in Bucyrus because our podcasts go out all over the place. So, yeah. yes, they're here located here in Bucyrus. Yes. All right, now, how long have you guys It's been Legacy now for how long? Uh, since May of uh, to, this year, to, yeah. 2023. Wow. Wow, so we I didn't realize it's been that, mm -hmm. quite frankly, that long. I know some people say, well, that's not long. It is. If, it is. Yeah, it, it's, it's been a while. Yeah, almost, well, we're coming up on January, so it's almost, you know, three quarters of a year. And I so. got to thinking also as well, now, I'm going to ask you about kind of a little bit of follow-up here, uh -huh. memory care unit. Yes. How's yes. that coming along? Uh, that's coming along great. Um, we're still getting a lot of uh, inquiries about it, and we want to make sure that we get um, information out there. So, with that being said, we kind of um, we've gotten um, a, some extra staff to help us get out into the marketing area and the hospitals to drive that memory care business. So, get the word out there to offer that help for those Alzheimer and dementia uh, residents that or in patients and family members and loved ones so well it's important uh, I tell people and you know, I've done this on other podcasts speaking with the same issue people need to be proactive and find out what their alternatives are before these things a lot of them it okay now I have somebody with dementia or Alzheimer's but I'm not prepared for it correct well, what's the likelihood? I would say the likelihood is fairly decent nowadays that you could end up with either one of these conditions. That's true. And so it doesn't hurt to do a little homework in advance. Right. And we have all kinds of information uh, mm -hmm. offering, you know, guidelines and signs and recognition of early onset, um, mm -hmm. you know, symptoms that they can, they can even go online to the Alzheimer's Association uh, because they do offer a lot of information there as well. So. I know the area agency on aging also has a lot of information on this type of, on various types of things with seniors and uh, aid the aging process. Because these are all part of the aging process. Yes. And it just depends on whether you have this particular diagnosis or not. But what I would like to encourage people is to check things out because you may not have this issue and maybe your grandmother doesn't have this issue or your mother, but the likelihood somebody along the line could have either one of these conditions. Right. Um, we're open to tours, uh, to tour the, our um, memory care unit, mm -hmm. you know, Monday through Friday, even Saturday, Sunday, we have managers on duty that it can give a tour as well. Mm -hmm. They do not have to make an appointment. They can just stop in and do an on-site tour. We're always ready and willing to offer that tour if anybody has um, any questions or concerns or would just like to see what it's about and what we have to offer. Well, how would they contact you? Can um, we... They can call the facility uh, at 419-562-9907 or they can stop in at our facility at 1170 West Mansfield Street right here in Bucyrus, Ohio. All right, so there's... Again, I'll give that number again. Uh, the phone number is 419-562-9907 here in Bucyrus. Yes. And again, the address is 11... What is that again? 1170. 1170. Mm -hmm. That's how I should remember that. 1170 West Mansfield Street here in Bucyrus. Yes. Any other things that we might want to get into? Any other programs or things kind of coming or maybe that you can... Give us a little insight into anything new? Um, yeah, like I had mentioned, the marketing uh, and our liaisons that are right. out there. We have uh, liaisons that are um, following up with Avita Health System hospitals for us, um, getting a hold of discharge planners to see if anybody needs assistance with um, skilled therapy. 
Uh, we do have Blue Sky Therapy located right in all of our buildings and they are uh, trained and certified uh, to you know, help and assist with anybody that needs physical therapy, occupational therapy, speech language therapy. So those are in all of our facilities, not just ours. So, um, and then they are in the Columbus marketing area as well, getting down into the Ohio State and a university. Um, they're going into Grant, Riverside, um, Ohio Health and Marion and Mansfield so that, um, you know, we can, you know, better serve our community and offer our services to everyone that's available. I guess when I think now about what you were just saying, you're pretty much a full service operation, but you want to let the public know. Yes, we have long term, um, we have uh, short term skilled, and we have our memory care uh, unit, which is a secured unit. It is not for behavioral issues, so uh, you know we understand that there are some behaviors with Alzheimer and dementia. Uh, they have to be able to meet a criteria to come into our facility. Um, they cannot be, you know, combative, uh, right. things like that, because we have to, you know, make sure our residents are um, very secure and, and safe as well as our staff. Well, I'll tell you, the eight months or so since May is or past, or eight or nine months of it has went fast. It has. You guys have accomplished a lot in a very short period of time. You should be proud of yourself that you did, because I know where you started. Yes. So, uh, you guys, guys made a great strides there. I wish you the best in the new year, and anything you know we can do, uh, we'd be more than happy to do it. Well, we appreciate uh, everything that you guys do, announcing and, and doing, um, you know, just our feed on the all of your sites. That's great. Yeah. So we appreciate that. We've been out to a couple of your events out there. Yes, you have. Unfortunately, yes. I can't get out to everything, as you will know. I'm knee deep in a lot of things. So yes. Uh, but uh, normally, some of our staff people get out if I don't, or so. Yes. But we do try to be involved as best as we can. Yes, we but, appreciate that. So. And we thank you again. I thank. Uh, I always want to Kimberly Keller. I just want to call you Kim. I really That's prefer that. Kim Keller from. Uh, Legacy Bucyrus Skilled Nursing and Rehabilitation yes. located here at 1170 West Mansfield Street in Bucyrus, Ohio. If you got further questions, you want to give them a call, well, you can go on their website. Yes. Or as well, uh, I take it to you on social media as well? Yes, we are. We're on Facebook. Okay. Yeah. And so they can uh, check either one of those out, or if you've got a. There's a virtual tour on there as well that yes. they can take. So. Um, yeah, it kind of gives you a little insight on what to expect when they do come to tour. Yep. So, and you know, know that it's not targeted to our facilities specifically. It's just one of our original ones. Right. Uh, so every facility is different, and we all have a unique memory care unit. Yeah. So. Well, it's good to know, and I think that's very good you brought up about that virtual tour. Yes. I think that's very helpful. If you still want to come out, you want to tour it, which is naturally everybody's going to do at some point if you're serious about it, you can give them a call out there, stop in, but the number to call if you have questions also is 419-562-9907. Yes. You can ask for ask, Kim. Ask for Kimberly with admissions. There you go, with admissions. All right, so we got titles and everything. Man, That's we, right. Everybody's got a title. I got a badge, too. And a badge, too. Well, <laughs> I've got badges, too, but the problem is uh, half the time I forget to put the badges on. So. Me, too, as you can see. Yeah. Thanks again <laughs> Thank uh, you. for being a part of the podcast today. Thank you, Dave.